Hello everyone, this is Nintendo Game Cup. Welcome back to our Crimson Time. Oh, excuse me, but yeah, um, we are on the adult section of the Spirit Temple, which is pretty awesome. So, yeah. Of course, I, I like the adult section more, but yeah. Since we can't go through that little hole, now that we have the silver gauntlets, that's their call, right? <laughs> yeah, well, now that we have these uh, gauntlets, we can push big blocks like this. I don't know how um, they make you stronger, but whatever. Oh, you. Just gonna use bomb juice on these guys. Which appear on the ceiling. <clears throat> Store. Um, I think I might go this way first. Yeah, this is where I want to be. Even though I don't think you're going really to get anything too important in here. Um, is there supposed to be a chest over there? Wait, hold on. Hmm. So yeah, I swear there there's supposed to be a chest up there. Huh. Unless that's only in Master Quest, but hmm. Is this supposed to be the scarecrow song or something? Or Oh wait. Ah, oh, there we go. That's what I'm supposed to do. I don't know why I'm wasting my time with this. This is nothing important. Um, I don't think there's even a cold circle shrine in here. Yeah, we got the compass. I think at the Master Quest version there's supposed to be enemies, those uh, sand enemies that come out of the ground and eventually you fight a purple one and something happens, I, I don't remember. I haven't even played Master Quest in a long time so I'm not even sure if I will ever open it, but maybe someday. Alright, another silver rook confirmed. Man, there, there's, a lot of, there's a lot more of these. In the skin that I remember. Let's see if we can get that to be a bit there. Oh, I missed it. Hold on a second. Let's see if this works. Stupid. Ugh. This will probably work, right? Yeah, it worked. Yeah, like I said, you can, um, this temple is intended to come before the Shadow Temple. Just, um, I believe somewhere in this temple it's easier to, um, deal with the, uh, iron boots, or not the iron boots, the hover boots. Um, there's actually a gold sculpture in there, but I'm going to try and resist and uh, ignore it. <laughs> Be it's being at the uh, double time block. Oh, nice. Nice throwing a like like at me. Was there invisible enemies in here, too? Hmm. Because it's only in the Master Quest version. Because <laughs> I'm getting uh, the two confused.
Alright, I'm not looking forward to what I'm going to do after this temple. You'll see it. Just... I guess it can be sort of a waste of time, but... Uh, I'm going for 100%. Well, for the most part, anyway. It's not gonna be full 100%, because like I said, I'm not getting the Gold Skull Plus. I'm not, I'm not sure if I can even get the... Uh, the uh, fourth bottle either because the, the last bow just went, won't show up. I know exactly where it is, but just I don't know. It's probably not gonna happen. But oh well. I'll get as much stuff as I can. Oh, there's a floor master in here. An invisible one. There we go. Nice yes, thing it gives us magic. It was uh, almost halfway um, empty. It's more of this. Um, three of these are fake and one of them is the real one. I think this is the real, uh, one. Yep. And obviously the fourth one is fake too. I'm pretty sure I know what this is, but I'm gonna open it anyway. Yep. It's a trap. Whatever. Doesn't do that much damage anyway. I don't know why I had to um, get all the uh, suns, but whatever. I think this is a real Stealthos. Come to life and then start chasing you. Probably. Hmm. Oh, maybe you do need a hover boost for this. I don't know. To get that switch over there. Because there's no way you can jump to it. Let's see. Yeah. Oh, we need a hammer for this. We haven't had to use this in a long time. Uh. There we go. We have to go on one of these hands and place all those little pie. I think it's this one here. Hmm. <clears throat> Obvious, but uh, in fact we can't even see the Triforce, so I'm just gonna guess. No, it's not this one. Huh. Oh, maybe that's where it just appears. Huh. How am I supposed to get back up there anyway? Huh. Well, I'll just go through here, I guess. Oh yeah, this, this room really leads to uh, nothing. It's pretty much just a, a shortcut, mm. if you need it. Yep, 
think this will just uh, bring us down to the uh, first room. So I'm not even gonna go down there. This was intended. Maybe uh, you, you are intended to go to the shadow temple first. I I don't know. There we go. I'm pretty sure I know what that is. Can we? See it from down here. Okay, now I believe that's the last time we'll need to use the hover boots, I hope. them both at the same time with our dense fire or your fire rose, whichever. Just quicker to do this. Oh man, I missed one. enemies with the, that fire there. Oh no, this room is tricky. Uh, all of these guys come to life, so um, what you need to do is, as you can see, this, this switch is, this switch only stays uh, down as long as something's on it, and all these guys come to life, none of them is just a statue, so wake them up. And, oops, I need one of them too. I hope he stays on it long enough. There we go. That wasn't too hard. But yeah, that could be tricky on your uh, first playthrough. Oh hey, another one of you. This is going to be tricky, especially with our big Goron sword. Ouch. Okay, you both. That, that's the only shot you're gonna get off of me. Okay, maybe not. Wow. Well, if I die, I have my fingers. Uh. 
like how quick you went down. And I love this sword. Sure, we can't use our CEO shield, but I hardly need to anyway, so... Treasure chest. Awesome. I, I guess the reason that wasn't there um, in the first place, unless you go through this uh, way, is so you can uh, hook shots, log onto it from over there. But yes, now we are our new uh, shield. It's the mirror shield, and uh, you'll see what it does soon enough. You know what, I'm gonna put my red tunic on because it looks good with uh, that. Oh, jeez, man, stupid graphic watch. You can't, you can't see the symbol that's on the mirror shield. Oh well, I think you can see it in the pause screen though. Yeah, this is another thing they changed in. Um, the later versions of this game. Do you see the a moon and uh, crescent star right there? Well, they, they, they basically changed it to something else. I don't even know how to describe what would they changed that to. Anyways, we don't even bother with these guys again, so I'm just gonna skip them. This is what the mirror shield does. It reflects light off of your shield. And you can aim it at the uh, sun too. Are we to finishing this place? We're actually, wow. Got the compass, we've been in pretty much every room, so you know what? Um, to avoid making this video really long, or making the next one too short, I'm going to end the part here, so yeah. I will see you guys next time on Ocarina of Time. Bye.